This short film is about the Eurasian Spoonbill and its recent colonisation of Holcombe National Nature Reserve and the efforts we make here on Holcombe Estate to maintain a safe and growing population. The Nature Reserve is on the North Norfolk coast on the eastern shores of England and covers an area of over 4,000 hectares which makes it the largest privately owned National Nature Reserve in the country. In the past it has been known for attracting tens of thousands of wintering wildfowl and good numbers of breeding waders. We have a wide range of habitats, grazing and salt marshes, sand dunes, beach, foreshore, pine woods and reed beds. The attractiveness to spoonbills is obvious. We have a vast juxtaposition of wetlands in a protected, mostly undisturbed environment. They can fly to feed in tidal creeks over a range of about 40 kilometres of the North Norfolk coast, which incorporates 2,200 hectares of salt marsh and a series of similarly protected wetland nature reserves. We have become a very important place nationally as spoonbills became extinct as a UK nesting bird between the late 1600s and the late 1990s due to persecution and habitat loss. Spoonbills have regularly been coming to Holcombe since the early 1990s and began to show an interest in a nesting egret and heron colony in a small willow wood within our marshland in the early 2000s. Numbers of summering birds increased and we finally proved successful nesting in 2010 when a colony of six pairs formed. This colony increased each year reaching a peak so far of 28 pairs in 2018. In nine years up to 285 youngsters have fledged, quite some feat we feel. Between 2010 and 2017 Holcomb was the only British nesting colony and due to the great successes in producing youngsters, it is fair to say we have kick-started a British revival as more birds are now wintering in southern England and also starting to nest in at least three other sites. We also know through sightings of birds with coloured rings put on them in countries such as Holland, France, Germany and Spain that there is a movement between many sites within England. We are currently hoping that with our growing success even more birds will begin prospecting in other sites and the British population can reclaim its former haunts and in even greater numbers. In regards to what we do at Holcombe, we maintain water levels at and around the nesting sites. We ensure protection and a disturbance-free nesting colony and we try where and when it is possible to view nests to record various aspects of behaviour, thus enabling us to gain a greater understanding of the spoonbill's ecology here in the UK. One of the things we are currently in the process of doing is creating more nesting habitat. By planting willow trees and oak trees in and around the existing colony, we are hoping to extend the boundaries of the colony and provide a future home for spoonbills for many more years to come.